Hello, buddy. This is Robert Hollis. I hope you're having a wonderful, blessed day. And today's title is Who Are You Pretending to Be? <laughs> uh, you can get my free book and a lot of free videos at roberthollis.com forward slash free and get my best selling book, How Is That Working? So, we'll allow Facebook and Mark Zuckerberg and the team to go out and start sharing it with people. Um, thank you so much, Bill. Nice to have, it, have you on here. Uh, so, so awesome. And uh, we'll get started here in just a few seconds. So there's Craig. Thank you very much, Craig. I didn't even know. Can I like like these comments on here? I can. Look at that. Uh, hi, John. Hi, Pat. Hi, Pam. Hey, Craig. Eric Markman. Nice to see you. John, that was so cool seeing your sermon. I think you should post it for everyone to see. <laughs> hi, Lisa Marie. Very nice to see you on here. Uh, love and appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much. Hi, Ilona. Hi, Kai. Convention countdown, absolutely. So we're after the minute, so let's get started. <clears throat> Hello, buddy. My name is Robert Hollis. Hope you're having a wonderful and blessed day. And today's title is, Who Are You Pretending to Be? Who are you pretending to be? Now, with that, happy Halloween to each and every one of you that are celebrating it. And... Uh, I find it really, really amazing. I brought this up in another video where I was talking about, you know, road trips. When I was young, uh, you know, me and some friends would take a road trip to another city. And one of the cool things about the city was that we would say, hey, no one knows us here. <laughs> no one knows us here. So we now can pretend to be the person that we want to be, right? So here we are on Halloween, and one of the unique things is that, you know, people dress up and they actually pretend to be something they're not. And I just find that so amazing, you know? So you can be a doctor, you can be, you know, uh, uh, whatever, you know? Um, and it's just really, really unique that we have the mentality, we have the, the mindset to actually mentally say, I'm going to act as if. I'm going to act as if. And so, you know, there's a lot of even biblical things behind this, you know, where you're supposed to, you know, what would Jesus do? You know what I mean? Or what would Muhammad do? Or <laughs> whatever, whatever uh, belief that you follow. But one of the things that's very unique is that we're in a position where it, that again is mindset. Just like being an actor or an actress you you got to have the mindset to say listen what does this person look like what does this person act like and so a lot of people don't realize that a lot of personal development development and how to change your mind is you act as if you act as if you're a master distributor you act as if you're a super affiliate you act as if you're in marketing and you're making way more than a full-time income. You act as if you already are there. And see, one of the things that I say to people all the time is, uh, what would, what would uh, I want to do a whole separate video on this, by the way, but what if, you know, most people that are successful, they're not happy before they're successful. So it's the whole mindset again, of it's like, listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna act happy. I'm gonna act, um, you know, like again as if, you know. I, I really don't know how to say it any other way. That's why I keep saying it the same way. <laughs> but you know, our mind is all, all pretty powerful, and we can do some amazing things. And so, you know, some people will will uh, act all kinds of uh, all kinds of ways but what if you act like a master distributor of my daily choice what if you act as if you were making a million a year see instead of being millionaire you make a million a year all right and you'll find that most people you have to learn to be that and stay in the right mindset of being able to find the right people to build your business so that you can have and live the life that you were created to live. 
So what's all in that pretend st state are what um, um, Albert Einstein would call imagination. Imagination. If we can learn to be like little kids again and imagine, imagine, isn't it funny that, uh, uh, I, I think it was um, Jenna Zweigel that posted, hey, I bought my kids uh, outfits early, you know, my their Halloween costumes early, and they've been wearing them for a month. <laughs> I love the imagination of of, uh, of kids. You know what I mean? It's like, hey, I'm 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 gonna dress up like this all the time. So I love and appreciate each and every one of you. Please do me a huge personal favor. Uh, share this with other people. And I know that a lot of people, in a negative way, sometimes pretend to be people they're not, uh, just to make other people happy. And if you're trying to pretend for somebody else and not yourself. Uh, that can be really, really not a good way. So be the person you want to be, become the person, and then that person will show up. Uh, love and appreciate you again. Share this and check out roberthollis.com forward slash free to get a copy of my free book. And we'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.